Well, here we are at Engineer Mountain. Uh, if things go well and I don't get too skittish, uh, we're gonna head up to the top of that. And amazing views all around here. Maybe I'll take some footage of the crux. I'm not too nervous. See you guys later. A little bit of off the trail that actually goes up to the summit of Engineer, but some pretty amazing views as you can see. We actually need to head back that way in and follow the ridge line up, but uh, yeah, really beautiful out here. Well, here's probably maybe not halfway, but we're ways up there. Pretty awesome views all around. Not much to block in or block the view from this height. Here's where we came from. It doesn't really do it justice looking down at it right now, but it's a decent steep hike. Well, here we are, the top of engineer. Definitely worth it. There's really and keep in mind, I'm nervous of heights. I'm surprised I made it. But uh, there's really only one section, pretty close to just a, actually, it's right at the crux where uh, not great footing, pretty steep, exposed. But other than that, not a bad hike. And if I can do it, you can do it. So hopefully, I come out here sometime. Bye. This is coming back down, engineer. As you can see, it's starting to get a little steep, but this is a section that's still pretty hikeable. Once you get a little further down, uh, I'll probably take a little footage there, but it's not hikeable. It's more of a climbing trail than hiking. So this is definitely some of the more technical stuff. Uh, I'm having a little trouble remembering, but I do believe so where we climb down, yeah, there's the crux right there. You can see that head popping up. So this will be kind of, this is definitely the most technical piece. The rest isn't that bad. Well, we're past the gnarly section right there, the crux. Now we're headed back down. It's the easy section that's pretty much runnable. It's a little steep, but pretty runnable. 